Hi, my name is Tony. Welcome to Tony's Hobbies. In this video we are going to extend this workbench from about here right up until about there. Have fun watching. To prepare for this project I made this drawing in Google SketchUp. On the right hand side you see a white thing that represents the current workbench and on the left hand side in a brownish color you see what represents the extension of the workbench. Uh, to create this we will need some lumber that I already bought earlier this week. Uh, it's on my lumber shelf. Uh, let's get to cutting it with the miter saw. Always use protective gear to save yourself some trouble. So the lumber has been cut to size, I will quickly uh, clean the edges up a bit and all we have to do after that is glue and screw. Let's get to gluing and screwing. This also illustrates nicely why I needed a bigger bench. So as you can see, I started with the top frame and now I'm building the frame that's going to be halfway um, of the workbench. And then I'll glue and uh, screw the legs to it. Okay, so I'm trying to figure out these measurements, uh, but it turned out I um, used the incorrect measurements when sawing, so I have to go back to the miter saw and cut a little bit off of these uh, parts. Okay, because the parts that I need to cut uh, are not going to be glued and it's just two pieces, uh, I decided to use a good old fashioned hand saw to do that. I'm using a square to make sure that all the uh, legs are perpendicular to the uh, frames. So 
So I want this, including a board on top, to be at the same height as this. So that I can nicely like, dry some hardwood without it um, curving. see the frame perfectly fits uh, the only thing we need to do is cut this board that I have here it's 40 centimeters that's about oh uh, 16 inches long uh, too long and I need to cut it off of it uh, but I don't have a circular saw so uh, I'll use my trick with some glue clamps and the jigsaw. I will make a reel uh, to guide the jigsaw. Let's get to it. So, all the boards have been cut, I can continue gluing and screwing and then uh, I have my project finished. But uh, first I have to remove all this stuff from my uh, old workbench. I'll clean it up later, but for now I'll just remove it quickly. So this part is finished, I only need to put on the big board, uh, which I am not going to glue uh, to this one, because um, in the future I might move to somewhere else, who knows, and I want these two to be separable. So I'm going to screw it onto this one with just a couple of screws, and I will glue and screw it uh, to this one. That was a lot of work, especially for a Saturday afternoon. But I had a lot of fun making this table and it turned out almost exactly like what I drew at the beginning of the video. So I'm, ha I'm very happy with it. I had a lot of fun making it. Um, I hope you had some fun uh, watching the video. And I will have a lot of fun with, uh, using this workbench in the future. So I hope you will follow me along. Thank you for watching. Bye bye. <laughs>